We will be talking about the three different states of water. Gas. The process in which liquid changes into gas is called evaporation. In order for liquid to change into gas, water must be at a boiling point of 100 degrees Celsius. The heat allows the molecules to have enough energy to follow through with the process of evaporation and separate from one another. Once this occurs, the liquid changes into gas. The gas itself does not take the form of its container. Liquid. Liquid is formed through the process of melting ice. Liquid is able to flow and take a shape of a container. In liquid forms, the molecules of water are more separated than in solid form because through the melting process, the molecules separate to form into liquid. Hydrogen bonds are created between the different molecules of water. This is an example of what hydrogen bonds look like in the process. Water in the solid form is ice. Water in solid form is ice. Ice is created through the process of freezing water. When ice is frozen, it expands and the volume becomes more dense which allows it to float. The solid form of water has many molecules placed tightly together, connected by hydrogen bonds. This is an example of an electron moving from one molecule to another.